Actually, really diligent in their efforts today to write down all of the, the the numbers of the license plates from all the cars that are honking as they pass. They're super, super diligent. Um, earlier, I spoke to a woman and she went over there and asked what they were doing with their notepads, and they declined to give an answer. So, we'll see. We're at a, a red light right now. What happens when the cars go by if they honk and if they pull out a notepad and start writing? There he goes, he's grabbing it. There he goes. Oh, he's got a photo instead because he was too slow to write it down. <laughs> Celine Gallus for Rebel News. And we are on week five of Geodi Gondek, City of Calgary, injunction against protesting. But as you can see, that has not stopped any of the individuals that have been coming here for the better half of two and a half years in order to peacefully protest the vaccine mandates. <laughs> I wanted to know people's opinion here today on why they believe that the federal government isn't giving an official statement that they're supposed to have released on the 6th as to if they will be dropping the federally mandated vaccine regulations for their workers or if they will be increasing it from two doses to three in order to be considered fully vaccinated and keep their jobs. Well, I, I think that... Hi there. Unfortunately, I cannot show you the opinions of the people that I interviewed due to YouTube's censorship policies. If you would like to see the entire video, please click the link in the description. If you're looking for a way to support Rebel News, you can go to rebelnewsstore.com and look at all the amazing merchandise that we have there. It's very rebellious, I'd say.